about to the channel. So I'm just down in, uh, just driving through Dartmoor actually. Never been here, it's the first time. I've come to check out uh, wild camping spots for the future. Uh, it's a beautiful uh, end of March, spring day. This is the warmest day of the year so far, at 23 degrees. So I'm on the, uh, on, I'm on the iPhone. I haven't got any of my other cameras with me, so obviously this is the, uh, but, uh, yeah, it's beautiful here, and I'm heading up to a place called Breakfast Tour. So, um, so I'm just uh, really down in the area, and I'm just, uh, yeah, just sort of checking it out, really. Uh, I've never been here, as I say before, uh, but it's, uh, it's the only place in the UK where you can legally wild camp. So you don't need to get a landowner's permission. Um, and I'm coming on a tip from Summit or Nothing, the guys at Summit or Nothing. Um, check out their channel. Oh, this is the best place to come to be new to Dartmoor and do a wild camp because uh, the cars, uh, cars, can you see that? The cars back down there. Um, so I'm just walking up this track to a place called Breakfast Tour. So I'll come back to you in a minute when the first thing that I noticed about Dartmoor was just the vast difference in anything that I've seen in the Lake District or the Peak District. It was just so exposed. You could just see how exposed it is. Just imagine if it was torrential rain, strong winds in the middle of winter. Here I was looking across to what I think were free tours as I was making my way up to a Great Mist Tour. Following this um, this track up to which I think this is Great Miss Tour up here, so it's pretty close to the car. I don't even I've got I haven't got the right footwear on ready for this, but um, luckily it's not too far. So let's see how let's see how we get to. It was a very gentle climb up to Great Miss Tour, but I just kept stopping all the time to just look at the the vastness of the place. Miss Tour here. It looks like there's like a, it's possibly like a circular walk which takes in these tours. Um, don't know, no idea what they are. But, um, but what, what a view, what, what a beautiful day for this. Wow. It's just starting to climb up to Great Miss Tour now. Um, yeah, it's just it's really like a gravel track really, so it's nice, nice short walk up here. Just noticed, the first thing I've noticed about that, there's a lot of wild ponies about. Um, they're sort of free roaming, so it's, uh, it's a nice sort of thing to see. So I'm trying to keep that iPhone still as possible. Sorry if it's jerky, because probably be the only video I do ever with my iPhone. Um, my Canon's got sort of the same. My G7X is, um, hasn't got the greatest of uh, stability as the, as the GoPro here at nine, which I don't really like. <laughs> um, it's got the best. So yeah. It's going to continue on, just give you some more, some more shots of the beautiful view, and yeah, let's keep going. So I started the sort of gentle sort of incline up to Kramer's Tour, which is here. There's a few, a couple of people up there, I think. Putting down here. See, it's, it's very rocky. I don't have my uh, ultras on. But yeah, this is a really just a gentle incline. So, I'll really catch you back when I get to the top. So, that's um, great. Miss Tour's a bit further on. I'm Unfortunately, I, I have to get, I haven't got time to get up there. Um, so I've got to head back, sadly. But um, yeah, I can see that being quite a good place to uh, get up there, pitch a tent. There's a lot of uh, rock formations up there, so you get plenty of shelter from the wind. Um, and you can obviously, I mean, tonight, 
the sunset's going to be phenomenal uh, and the sunrise uh what's that over there you can see uh a river over there is that the river dart possibly uh could be the river dart you can see a bridge going over but yeah amazing place um i'll bring you a, a wild camp here at some point um i'm not a million miles away so but yeah i just really wanted to because it's a beautiful day to, to got an iphone on me so i just wanted to shoot this video there's quite a few people up there to be honest with you uh, but i will bring you a wild camp from up there at some point soon all right so yeah just making our way back down to the car now um yeah definitely as i say I've, uh, if you're watching this you might have been here done a wild camp you, you might be uh from this area but this is the first time i've ever explored dartmoor so there's obviously a lot to it um you know it's very very vast isn't it i can just imagine on a, a terrible day of weather how bad it could, things could be uh it's just no shelter it's just very exposed i mean if this is torrential rain and 50 mile an hour winds uh you know you've got nowhere to kind of uh, shelter it's like some ditches and gullies and stuff here i suppose but uh yeah it's a beautiful place and uh delighted to uh, to take advantage of this fine weather to, to come and explore it a little only if it's just a little tiny bit but um you know there's a lot of wildlife about birds here so yeah just imagine a sunset here It'd be fantastic I can just, is that the coast let's just make out the coast um, so i'm going to head back to the car in this video uh and uh yeah so thanks for watching uh, i know it's a pretty much quite a brief video but um yeah let's just take let's take a gander another gander you know it's a beautiful day beautiful beautiful scenery all around so i hope you enjoyed the video uh, i hope maybe you find something on uh my channel djv outdoors that might have interested you uh i've got a couple of wild camps on here um so please yeah if you like the video uh, if you hit the like button uh that that sort of really helps uh helps my helps my channel and stuff so i appreciate that um and yeah please yeah please subscribe of course um subscribe to the channel uh i post regular videos mostly one a week so um it's a regular sort of content outdoor content mostly obviously getting up into the hills while camping and stuff like that so uh as well as some long distance walks that sort of thing so yeah thanks for watching guys and um and i'll see you soon bye